Well, I'm in Nashville. I flew in from Houston last night. And, of course, my bag didn't make it. And I only have one bag, and it was one non-stop. No changing planes. It just put the bag. And they charge you $20 to not, to not deliver your bag. But I'm not, it's all the airlines. I'm not blaming any one of them. It's Continental, but I have to fly Continental. They're, they are big in Houston, and I like Continental, and I like Delta. I like them all when they just, if you're going to charge $20 for a bag, at least refund the money when you don't deliver the bag. That's what I say. Oh. Here we are. Hi. This is my little boy haircut. That's what my wife calls it. She calls it your little boy haircut? When people see me that are not used to see me this way, they think I've got, gotten some kind of new haircut. It's not. Uh-uh. This is why my hair is at home. On stage is what you see on stage, but. Yeah. And this is the way my, this is my old man haircut. If I don't have to look nice, I'm going to look nice. Because I don't spike it up when <laughs> I'm on the day off. It's good. I like the color. Thank you. Oh, careful. Sorry, about messed up the goods there. Sorry. What are you doing, Kevin? I'm just waiting. I'm just, just, uh, what did you say a minute ago? A dollar waiting on a dime? Yeah, a dollar waiting on a dime. We're waiting on David and Michael. We're just dollars waiting on dimes. We're always waiting on them. We're always, always waiting on them. Always. They're supposed to be here at 10 for this flight, and of well, course they're not. Yeah. Our flight leaves This is what we do. We wait. I had a three-hour drive, and guess what time I was here? 9.30. You had a three-hour drive this morning from Birmingham. I got up at 5.55. Five-hour drive. Yep. And I-40 is closed. So I had to go around it. And you're here? He was here I at 9.30. Here at 9.30. I had a 20-minute drive this morning. And I flew from Houston last night so I could make sure I'm here on time. But now, we're waiting on some people, right? We're waiting on who? David, David and Michael. And Michael. Oh, they're yeah. not here. Yeah, the dimes saying. are not are not here yet. <laughs> the dollars are here. They're, yeah, we're here. Yeah. Dollar waiting on a dime. Use well, that. I heard Jerry sense. Falwell <laughs> use that one time when he was waiting on the Sounds of Liberty. They were late, and he was mad. He said, dollar waiting on a dime. And I thought, oh, that's brilliant. I love that. I've used that on Bill several times. Of course, it doesn't have the same effect. Because his dimes are a lot more than my dollars. <laughs> he has expensive dimes. He does. His old dimes. His dimes were made when the mint first went into business. Actually, it was profitable. Yeah, he can remember when rainbows were in black and white. I think there's some oh, here come the dimes. <laughs> I think there's some country stars, but I don't really know country music. We don't know country music, but there's country. Oh, there's David. He showed up. Finally, here's Dark. <laughs> hey. he's, he's the voice. The voice? Mm -hmm. Is that what it is? Well, he, he, he likes me to call him the voice. No more nice. Yeah. I, call him, I call him Mr. The Voice. Yeah, we were in Europe, and David thought they were saying, no more night. No, but they were saying, no more tonight. That's what they were saying. No more tonight. <laughs> Oh, we have fun, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> How about I turn this off?